We simply have to focus on this man. Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. It's Inter, they face Benfica, and the action is next, live on EA TV. Good evening, everyone. Tonight, we're talking to you from one of the special venues in European football, the San Siro, here in the city of Milan. I'm Derek Ray, ready here in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and commentary midfielder, Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Inter up against Benfica and flag raised offside well that was always going to be offside he just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer and a look at the inter team jan zoma is the goalkeeper but and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save who can they pick out every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one joao mario it's with Rafa. Manera Zuri regaining possession. Good physical play. Well, it's a decent looking attack, this. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, Lautaro Martinez revels in delighting the fans and a fair chance he might do that in this game. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Joao Mario... Oh, nice ball over the top. Having to shoot. And he's kept it down. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, trying to build a head of steam. Another corner it'll be. For another corner, can they cash in? Over it comes. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Can they hit on the break? Teammates in the middle. A deft clearance. Effective piece of pressing. Otamendi. Otamendi has it. Benfica unable to retain possession. Oh, good vision. He might profit from here, you know. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. The weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Well, it's a good-looking position. Is there a goal in the future? Oh, great defending. Not the best challenge. Free kick. Di Marco. Mkhitaryan. 
He could pick out a teammate. Can he finish? Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box. Just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And he does well to read the flight of the ball, to be fair almost just cushions it beyond the goalkeeper and that seemed to catch him off guard a really good controlled finish so back underway with the lead standing at 2-0 Di Maria Di Maria how about the cross? Oh, this is looking promising. I think they were expecting a bit more from that attack. And he stopped them in their tracks. Oh, he's through here. Still alive. Well, threat over for now. Given away by Benfica. Now, who can he play it to? A smart stop here. And he's fired over the corner. Well, not cleared away completely. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. So, a corner here. And he takes it on! Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. The corner kicks keep on coming. Has eyes for goal! Defending really well. Well, there it is. Inter have created chance after chance. And I just can't see that changing. They've been excellent here. Di Maria... This looks more than decent. And a vigorous effort, but denied by the woodwork. Well, from that sort of distance, it's a chance that should be taken. Chalanolu. And Benfica with the ball once more. This is looking threatening. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. The referee is given a corner. And played in by Di Maria. It hasn't come to very much. Can he finish? And a fine stop to turn the ball away. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. Di Maria and he might be through here a goal as they cut into their advantage still plenty of life in this match well he wasn't going to waste this chance 1v1 against the keeper and he slots it away with great confidence that's a good finish And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. And plenty of space for this inter-attack. Giving it a try. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And the first half is in the history books here at the Meazza. Rafa catching the eye in the first half here. What did you make of him? Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately... Well, it's advantage Inter after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from the issue being settled here. 
Now, what does Di Maria have in store for the defenders? Chance to equalise. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. And Inter could get in behind the defence. Martinez! And the keeper, there's the deal with it. Aursnes. Artur Cabral. Di Maria now. Closing down well. It needs an accurate cross. Pulls it back. Oh, a goal! They've done it! Quite the comeback, this! Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Good ball over the top. Dumfries. Oh, heading it narrowly over the top. And foul it is then. It's a neat move. Can he finish? And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Not the pass he had in mind. Promising pass. It's a perfect challenge. Oh, great play. And a fine stop to turn the ball away. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Opportunity it is. Oh, goodness me. Meat and drink for the keeper. Well, you expect him to score from there, but he just got it all wrong, didn't he? Moving it forward. Joao Mario. Just the challenge that was required. And passing it through. Oh, could be a chance. Now the conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Excellent defending. And into the last 20 minutes. Benfica couldn't keep the ball. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Corner kick played in. And not a header that was ever really going to trouble the goalkeeper. Nothing productive, really. Frederick Aursnes. Di Maria now. 
Rafa. And here's Joao Mario. Nicely timed tackle. Barella. Back to Turam. Quadrado might want it. And we had a decent reading of that ball in. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here's the replay. It all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. in the game here and they know what they've got to do this could level it pretty simple for the keeper he'll have a go here oh from miles out he's done it how about that for a pure strike terrific technique wondrous And the referee blows for a foul. And he read it well. Cabral. And possession lost by Inter. Oh, managing to beat him. And still looking for space. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Martinez. He's in with a chance. In position. Oh, yes! You have to marvel at the sheer spectacle of it. Taking everyone by surprise. Yet at the same time, we know just how capable he is. A special moment. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and the finish is just so clever. He lets the ball go behind his standing leg, then flicks it beyond the keeper. That's a brilliant goal. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, he stopped it. Well, I thought that would be a goal, but what a save. Great reactions. He'll try his luck here. Didn't miss by very much. Yeah, he adjusted his body so well there. It's a great piece of skill, and it probably deserved the goal. And that will do it here, and that will do nicely for Inter. It's a victory on match day one, Stuart. Yeah, it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages. They'll be happy with the three points, but now they have to back it up in the next game. Six points, and you're halfway there. Well, it was a standout performance from Marcus Turam, and it's not the first time we've said that. Stuart, he turned on the style yet again. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat, and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.